run up through Wildwood Trail. Now we're going to stress out the muscles a little bit. Hello. I am just some context editing this in my car realized that the microphone audio and these next few clips are peaking so I apologize for a little bit of distortion and here's a little sneak peek of what's to come I'm in my car um, stuck in the middle of like a national forest because um, because of this stuff and my car not being able to get through it I don't have any signal so I'm just waiting on this road. It's been like three hours. Nobody's come. So I figured I'd edit a video while I wait. Let's continue. Great workout. Uh, it's just what I needed before a long road trip. So we are headed on out. We're going to a, a special place. A place I got. A little tip that is a, just a little nugget. A little gem. A little unfound treasure of Oregon. On my way out to Boise, Idaho to see the family. To have a good Thanksgiving. <sighs> Looking forward to it. But first, we gotta knock out some errands, gather some goods to bring to the family. Let's get to it. If you saw the episode a couple days ago, you saw I finished my journal. So, top of the list, gotta get a new one. Here we are, paper source. Hey, I don't have one. Choices, choices. We went with the five minute journal, again, for a friend to see how she likes it. And then I just went with like the classic moleskin just to give myself some more room to just free flow. I swear, sometimes the best meals go down when you're just trying to use up the rest of your ingredients before you head out. Look at that. That looks amazing. Just a good mushy delight. Great for the road. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, got to wrap up the rest of the gear, pack the skis, pack the snacks. Yeah. We got to get out of here. We got to stop dilly-dallying and get out because we have a destination, a beautiful destination waiting for us ahead. So whew, let's wrap it up and get out. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. We got all the gear, we got all the snacks, we got all the things. Now let's get our butt on the road. Not before though, we pick up one last little taste of Portland to bring to the festivities. This is the spot. Oils, freshly pressed oils and vinegars. Mmm. Ooh. They're closed. Oh no. <laughs> oh, look at it in there. Oh, all of the fresh oils and vinegars. Just within reach. Shoot. We're gonna have to get something else then. We're going to Eben and Melissa's house, and they used to live here. They, Eben's my brother, you'll meet him in a sec. And uh, yeah, they, uh, they're the ones that turned me on to Portland. They moved here first, first from the fam, but they recently left, so I want to bring a taste of Portland to get them to miss it more, you know? I'm trying to get them back here. So, what should we get? And this place where we taste oils and vinegars, that was one of the first places they took me. It's really fun. But they're closed. On a in the middle of the day on a Tuesday. It's not great for business. Given we have amazing wine country, I um I picked up some wine. Hopefully that ought to water the seed. Moses, we have made it. Or should I say, Holy Joseph. 
because that's where we are. <sighs> six hours later, six hours east of Portland, two hours east of Boise, Idaho, our destination for tomorrow. <clears throat> Joseph, Oregon, nestled in the Wallowa Mountains. And uh, we'll be sitting cozy in a little Airbnb. Not too shabby. Hello. Welcome. Time to get cozy. Good night.